For this variation of a squat, you can use body weight, you can use two dumbbells, one dumbbell, you can use two kettlebells or one kettlebell. The options, if you are holding weight, would be here, here, or here for a front squat. All right, from here, separate your feet hip width apart, toes pointing forward or slightly out to the side. Engage your core, draw your shoulders down and back and shoulder blades together. Sit your hips back and bend your knees into a squat, inhaling. And now as you exhale, we're gonna press up through our heels. And as we do so, we're gonna rotate at about a 45 degree angle to the side. So if you think about your body kind of being in a box, we're gonna rotate toward this corner, maybe even a little bit past it. We're not gonna rotate way over here. We just got a little bit of an angle going. As we do that rotation, a couple things are gonna happen. So we're pressing up powerfully, pressing through our heels to drive our body upward. We're rotating and lifting the heel of the foot that we're moving away from. So this foot has to pivot. That way our knee isn't moving outside of our foot. We've got our foot and knee moving together. We're gonna squeeze through our glutes on this side, core stays engaged. Then we'll come back to center, lower down, and exhale. Switch sides, now I've got the other side working hard. Think about this being a powerful movement and squeeze right here. So it's a powerful movement because we're pressing up with power and it's a really nice tight squeeze through the outside of our glutes and our glutes in general, but especially right here through our gluteus medius. All right, a couple more reps to show you. 